Question 1. Brooke is designing a new database. She is aware that performance may be an issue with this database because it is likely to store a large number of documents. Which of the following methods can she not use to help improve the performance of her view? Do not record on red marks. Optimize document table map. Minimize use of categorized columns that display multiple values. Designate more than one column for sorting and views. Answer is B. Optimize document table map. This is not an option when designing views. Rather, this is an option on the advanced tab of the database properties box. This option, however, does improve performance for the database in general. Question 2. What is the minimum database ACL rights required to update a full text index on a database that already has been full text indexed by the database manager? Manager. Designer. Editor. Author. Anyone can update an existing full text index. Answer is B. Designer. A user can have designer access, the minimum access displayed, or hire to create, update, or delete a full text index. Answer A is incorrect because even though the manager can indeed update the full text index, that is not the minimum access required, as specified in the question. Answer C and E are incorrect because these users have insufficient access rights to update a full text index. Answer E is incorrect because, as previously mentioned, only designers and managers can update the full text index. Question 3. Profile documents provide what benefits for application development? Profile documents are not directly viewable and editable. Profile documents are cached. Profile documents are automatically encrypted. Both A and B. Answer is D. Both A and B. Answer C is incorrect because profile documents are not automatically encrypted. Question 4. Which embedded element allows you to interact with a calendar view? Date picker. Folder pane. Single category view. Editor. Answer is A. Date picker. Answer B is incorrect because a folder pane displays documents in a folder. Answer C is incorrect because a single category view is used to show only documents for a particular category. Answer D is incorrect because an embedded editor is used to edit documents. Question 5. What are the two types of layers? Transparent and opaque. Top and bottom. Translucent and opaque. Upper and lower. Answer is A. Transparent and opaque. Layers can be either transparent or opaque. Question 6. A data connection resource, DCR, is used to do what? Export data to XML. Import data to XML. There is no such thing as a DCR. Connect to legacy database systems. Answer is D. Connect to legacy database systems. Answers A and B are incorrect because DCRs are used to connect to legacy systems. Answer C is incorrect because DCRs are new to Domino 6. Question 7. By default, the effective user of an agent is underscore. The user running the agent. The username specified for the agent. The user who last signed the agent. Answer is C. The user who last signed the agent. Answer A is incorrect because the user running the agent is only the effective user when the run as web user option is enabled. Answer B is incorrect because usernames are not specified for an agent except when the new run on behalf of feature is enabled. Question 8. In Domino 6, Agent restrictions are set where? The server document in the Domino directory. The agent properties box. The design properties box. A and B. Answer is D. A and B. Answer C is incorrect because agent restrictions are controlled only in the server document and in the agent properties box. Question 9. The new files resources design element provides which capabilities? Sharing on NSF files in an application. Replicating non-NSF files with other design elements. Converting HTML to XML. Converting text to HTML. A and B. Answer is E. A and B. Answer C and D are incorrect because file resources are not used to convert files from one type to another. Question 10. Which statement is true concerning the use of data connection resources, DCRs? DCRs replace a lookup and a deep column. You must make calls to the native database drivers. A data source must be configured on the server before you can create a DCR. DCRs don't replicate. Answer is C. Answer A is incorrect because DCRs don't replace at formulas. Answer B is incorrect because you don't need to make calls to native database drives. Answer D is incorrect because DCRs do replicate. Question 11. Which of the following options is not valid for the schedule of an agent? Never. Daily. Yearly. Monthly. Answer is C. Yearly. 
never, monthly, and daily are all valid scheduling options, making answers A, B, and D incorrect. Question 12. Which is not supported for web clients? Encrypted fields. Names fields. Readers fields. Authors fields. Answer is A. Encrypted fields. Web users cannot read encrypted fields. B is incorrect because names field are supported on the web. C is incorrect because readers fields are supported on the web. D is incorrect because authors fields are supported on the web. Question 13. The administration server specified for a database is responsible for what? Compacting the database? Monitoring database size and enforcing quotas? Selecting encryption keys? Keeping names in the ACL and optionally in the names field synchronized with the domino directory? Answer is D. The administration server's admin process is responsible for keeping names in the ACL and optionally in the names field synchronized with the domino directory. A is incorrect because the compact task compacts databases. B is incorrect because the administration process does not enforce quotas. C is incorrect because the administration process has nothing to do with encryption. Question 14. Encrypting fields on a document restricts access to what? The document. The contents of the encrypted fields. The database. You cannot encrypt fields, only documents. Answer is B. The contents of the encrypted fields. Only the fields that have been encrypted require an encryption key to access them. A and C are incorrect because field-level encryption blocks access to only certain fields. D is incorrect because you can encrypt fields. Question 15. The execution control list, ECL, is responsible for what? Scheduling agents. Controlling who can change the ACL of a database. Controlling who can run code and what code can do on a workstation. Controlling who can run code and what code can do on a server. Answer is C. ECLs are used to control who can run code on a workstation and what that code can do. A is incorrect because the ECL has nothing to do with scheduling agents. B is incorrect because the ECL has nothing to do with changing the database ACL. D is incorrect because ECLs only affect execution on the notes client. Question 16. Enabling the enforce a consistent access control list property for a database does what? Ensures that server-based databases have a consistent ACL on all replica copies. Ensures that only an administrator can change a database's ACL. Enforces ACLs on local databases stored on a workstation. Ensures that local databases have a consistent ACL on all replica copies. Both C and D. Answer is E. Both C and D. When the enforce a consistent access control list property is enabled for a database, it ensures that all local replicas maintain a consistent ACL and that the ACL of the database is enforced locally. B is incorrect because enforce consistent access control list doesn't affect who can change the ACL. Only those with manager access in the ACL can change the ACL. C is incorrect because enforce consistent access control list also ensures that local databases have a consistent ACL on all replica copies. D is incorrect because enforce consistent access control lists also enforces ACLs on local databases stored on a workstation. Question 17. Which of the following are valid design element security options? Server access list. Form create list. View access list. Both B and C. Answer is D. Both B and C. Both form create list and view access list are security options that can restrict access to design elements. A is incorrect because a server access list restricts access to the server. B and C are incorrect because both form create lists and view access lists are valid design element security options. Question 18. Where is field level encryption controlled? Individual fields cannot be encrypted. The info tab of the field properties box. The form info tab of the form properties box. The advanced tab of the field properties box. Answer is D. The advanced tab of the field properties box. Field level encryption options are set on the advanced tab of the field properties box. A is incorrect because individual fields can be encrypted. B is incorrect because field level encryption settings are controlled on the advanced tab of the field properties box. C is incorrect because field level encryption settings are controlled on the advanced tab of the field properties box, not the form properties box. Question 19. Extended ACLs, SACLs, can be used in which type of database? Databases using the log.ntf template, such as the notes log. Any database. Databases using the pubnames.ntf template, such as the domino directory or an extended directory catalog. Databases using the pernames.ntf template, such as a personal address book. Answer is C. 
Extended ACLs help delegate administration tasks and databases using the pubnames.ntf template. A, B, and D are incorrect because extended ACLs are only used with databases based on the pubnames.ntf template. Question 20. Roles simplify database administration and can be used where to grant or deny access in a database. Form compose list. View read list. Readers fields. All of the above. Answer is D. All of the above. Roles can be used in any of the access control elements listed in this question. A is incorrect because roles can also be used in view read lists and readers fields. B is incorrect because roles can also be used in form compose lists and readers fields. C is incorrect because roles can also be used in form compose lists and view read lists. Question 21. Encrypted email sent to other Domino users uses which type of key? Secret key. Public key. User key. One-way hash. Answer is B. Public key. Notes mail uses public key encryption. A is incorrect because notes mail uses public key encryption. C is incorrect because user key encryption is not a valid concept in notes. D is invalid because one-way hashing is only used in notes to protect users' passwords. Question 22. Public and private keys can be used to do all but what? Encrypt mail. Encrypt databases. Sign subforms. Sign sections. Answer is C. Sign subforms. Public and private keys cannot encrypt subforms. Answers A, B, and D are incorrect because public and private keys can be used to encrypt all three of these element types. Question 23. Jake wants to create a secret encryption key. How would Jake go about doing this? Open the user security dialog box by selecting file, user preferences from the pull-down menu. Open the user security dialog box by selecting file, security, user security from the pull-down menu. Select Create, Encryption Key from the pull-down menu. Users cannot create encryption keys. Jake must contact the system administrator. Answer is B. The User Security dialog box can be opened from the pull-down menu by selecting File, Security, User Security. Then clicking on Notes Data, Documents from the left navigator opens the Document Encryption screen. From there, Jake clicks on New Secret Key to open the New Secret Encryption Key dialog. Answer A is incorrect because this option has been moved since release 5. Answer C is incorrect because this is not a valid menu option. Answer D is incorrect because, as previously mentioned, the system administrator does not need to be contacted to create a new secret key. Question 24. Which of the following keyword field types displays the list of people, servers, groups, and roles in the ACL of the current database? Use access control list for choices. Use address dialog for choices. Use names dialog for choices. Use view dialog for choices. Answer is A. Use access control list for choices. The keyword field type of use access control list for choices displays the list of people, servers, groups, and roles in the ACL of the current database. Answer B is incorrect because the use address dialog for choices displays the name dialog box to select names from the domino directory. Answer C is incorrect because there is no names dialog. Answer D is incorrect because the use view dialog for choices displays a dialog box displaying entries from a column in an existing view. Question 25. If a user is listed both explicitly and implicitly in the database ACL, what is true regarding the rights granted to the user? The lowest rights granted take precedence. The highest rights granted take precedence. The rights granted in the group take precedence. The rights granted to the explicit name take precedence. Answer is D. Despite which access rights are higher between the explicit listing and the groups, the rights granted to the explicit name take precedence. Answer A, B, and C are wrong because which rights are highest, or lowest, are irrelevant when the user is explicitly listed. Question 26. A document was previously created using the store form and document. Since then, the following items were removed from the document, dollar $Title, dollar $Info, dollar $Window Title, and dollar $Body. Which of the following options takes precedence in determining the form with which the document is opened? Form stored in document. Form formula. Form item value. Default form, answer is B. Form formula. If the dollar title, dollar info, dollar window title, and dollar body items are removed, effectively the form stored in the document is removed as well. Therefore, answer A is incorrect and B is correct because the next item to be used based upon its precedence is the form formula, if one has been specified in the view. Answer C and D are incorrect because they have a lower precedence than B. Question 27. Roles help define and further refine control and user capabilities within the application. 
Using roles, you can programmatically control who can do all of the following, except access specific views and folders, create documents and edit documents, read documents, access sections within documents. All of the above are correct. Answer is E. All of the above are correct. Roles can programmatically control who can do all of the options displayed. Question 28. To encrypt a section in Domino, you must do what? Nothing. Sections cannot be encrypted. Choose an encryption key in the section properties. Sign the section and it will be automatically encrypted. Add an encrypted field to the section. Answer is D. Add an encrypted field to the section. You must add an encrypted field to the section. A is incorrect because adding an encrypted field to the section encrypts it. B is incorrect because you must use an encrypted field. C is incorrect because signing a section does not automatically encrypt it. Question 29. What are the four types of applets Lotus provides to enhance web applications? Form, View, Action Bar, Calendar. Calendar, View, Action Bar, Editor. Outline, Action Bar, Editor, View. View, Editor, Outline, Form. Answer is C. Outline, Action Bar, Editor, View. The four types of applets are Outline, Action Bar, Editor, and View. A is incorrect because there is no form or calendar applet. B is incorrect because there is no calendar applet. D is incorrect because there is no form applet. Question 30. With what types of fields can the editor applet be used? Text and rich text. Rich text only. Text only. The editor applet can be used only for in-view editing. Answer is B. Rich text only. The editor applet works with rich text fields only. A and C are incorrect because the editor applet can be used only with rich text fields. D is incorrect because the editor applet is used to edit rich text fields on the web. Question 31. In view editors provide what functionality? Allow users to edit a document in a view without opening it. Mimic notes client view functionality on the web. Enable users to create new documents from a view. Both A and C. Answer is D. Both A and C. In view editors enable you to edit a document without opening it and enable users to create new documents from a view. B is incorrect because in view editors allow users to create and edit documents from a view. A and C are incorrect individually because an in view editor can provide both functions. Question 32. What does option declare do? Requires explicit variable declaration in formula. Requires explicit variable declaration in Lotus script. Allows implicit variable declaration in formula. Allows implicit variable declaration in Java. Answer is B. Option declare requires explicit variable declaration. A, C, and D are incorrect because option declare is used with Lotus script. Question 33. The new customizable tools menu enables you to do what? Run custom formulas. Run commonly used applications. Both A and B. Answer is C. Both A and B. A is incorrect because the new customizable tools menu enables you to run commonly used applications as well. B is incorrect because the new customizable tools menu enables you to run custom formulas as well. Question 34. JavaScript is generally used to write programs that execute where? Domino server. Notes client only. Web client, browser, only. Both B and C. Answer is D. Both B and C. A is incorrect because JavaScript is normally used for client-side scripting. B is incorrect because JavaScript can be used in web clients as well. C is incorrect because JavaScript can also be used in Notes client applications. Question 35. The Find and Replace feature in the Designer Client can be used to search for text within what scope? Current section only, current object, all objects, all objects in database. Current selection, current object, all objects, all objects in database. Current section only, current object, all objects. Answer is C. Current section only, current object, and all objects. A is incorrect because all objects in database is not a valid option for scope. B is incorrect because current selection is not an option for scope nor is all objects in database. Question 36. The new view event in Vuted enables what feature for developers? Nothing, there is no in Vuted event. Allows developers to write code that determines what is done in views that allow in view editing. Allows users to conditionally hide columns. Allows users to change the colors of a view. Answer is B. In viewed it enables developers to write code that determines what is done in views that allow in view editing. A, C, and D are incorrect because the in viewed it event works with the new in view editing capability. Question 37. 
The new autocomplete feature helps developers with which coding options? JavaScript and Java. Java and Lotus Script. Lotus Script and JavaScript. Lotus Script and Formula. Answer is D. Lotus. Script and Formula. Autocomplete helps Lotus Script and Formula programmers. A, B, and C are incorrect because neither Java nor JavaScript have autocomplete. Question 38. All of the following are design elements available to web clients as Java client-side applets except for which one? Embedded outline. Embedded view. Text editor. Scheduler control. Answer is D. Scheduler control. The scheduler control is available for notes clients only and, therefore, is not available for web clients. Answers B, C, and D are all incorrect because they can be used on the web and all have the web access. Display using Java applet option. Question 39. Domino web applications cannot contain connectors to which of the following? SQL Server. SAP slash R3. Six transactional system. Connectors can be created for all of the above. Answer is D. Connectors can be created for all of the above. All the options are available for Domino to create connectors to. Specifically, connectors can be created for relational databases, such as Oracle, DB2, SQL Server, MySQL, etc. Enterprise resource planning systems, such as SAP slash R3, and transactional systems, such as 6, IBM MQ series, and IMS. Therefore, answers A, B, and C are incorrect because they are incomplete. Question 40. The statement provides a visual tool and high-performance server environment used to create web applications that provide live, native access to enterprise data and applications is the definition of what? Domino connectors. Domino Enterprise Connection Services, DECS. Data Connection Resource. Lotus Enterprise Integrator. Answer is B. The Domino Enterprise Connection Services provides a visual tool and high-performance server environment used to create web applications that provide live, native access to enterprise data and applications. DEX includes a wizard interface that enables users to define external data source connections to DB2, Oracle, Sybase, ADA SQL, SAP R3, ODBC, and text files. Users can define files within a Domino database that can be automatically updated with the external connector data. Question 41. When using the Domino Designer client to add a hotspot to an image located on a form or page, which of the following is not an option located by clicking on picture from the drop-down menu? Add hotspot rectangle. Add hotspot circle. Add hotspot polygon. Add hotspot square. Answer is D. Add hotspot square. The option to add a hotspot square is not an option from the menu. However, you could select the option to add hotspot rectangle and shape the rectangle as a square. Answers A, B, and C are incorrect because they are all valid options when adding hotspots to images. Question 42. All of the following are navigational tools for your use when designing applications for the notes client or web client, except Outline Navigator Navigation Applet Image Map Answer is C. Navigation Applet There is no such thing as a navigation applet included with notes. Answer A is incorrect because an outline is included with notes, which creates an organizing structure for an application and gives you control over how elements display in a navigation pane. Answer B is incorrect because a navigator is also included with notes and is defined as objects and graphics that include programmed areas that provide a graphical roadmap directing users to specific parts of a database. Answer D is incorrect because an image map is also included with notes that allows you to enhance your applications with programmable hotspots that perform some action when a user clicks on them. Question 43. Within Kirsten's database, she wants web users to be able to read scheduled documents only and have no access to anything else. She has set the ACL to no access with read public documents rights, and she has created a form and special view made available to public access users through their properties. What does Kirsten still need to do to complete her application? Create a computed field with a formula public access equals 1. Create a computed field name dollar public with a formula 1. Create a computed field name dollar public access with 1 in the programmer's pane. Create a computed field with public access equals 1 in the programmer's pane. Answer is C. To allow public access, four things are required. ACL set to allow no access with public document rights in the database. A view set to allow public access so users can see the documents. The form set to allow public access and a dollar public access field with a value of 1. Answers A, B, and D are not correct because there are no such parameters. 
Question 44. Noah wants to hide a field from web users, yet he wants to be able to access the field through JavaScript. He has used the field property hide paragraph from web users, yet when he tests the form the field value is not being rendered to the web. What else needs to be done? When you hide a field, the field and its value are not rendered to the web. What Noah is trying to do cannot be done. Select the Generate HTML for All Fields option on the default tab of the form property. Select the Generate HTML for All Fields option on the default tab of the field property. Use the reserved field name $hidden. Answer is B. Using the field hide when in conjunction with the form Generate HTML for All Fields will make this field a web hidden data type. Answer A. Though the first part by itself is correct, is incorrect as it can be done. Answer C is incorrect as this attribute is located on the field property. Answer D is incorrect as there is no such reserved name. Question 45. What are the two domino JSP tag libraries? Tags.tld and util.tld. Domtags.tld and domtags.util. Collab.nsf and utility.nsf. Domtags.tld and domutil.tld. Answer is D. Domtags.tld and domutil.tld. Answers A, B, and C are incorrect as there are no such name files. Question 46. Tiffany would like to use her existing notes application on the web. She has some Lotus Script agents she would like to continue to use. How can Tiffany incorporate Lotus Script agents into her web apps? If they currently work for her notes clients, there is nothing she has to do. Lotus Script does not work on the web and therefore cannot be utilized in her web app. The on submit event allows use of Lotus Script. Use the web query save and web query open events. Answer is D. Though Lotus Script cannot be used directly on the web, manually run, shared agents can be accessed through the events web query open and web query save. Answer A is incorrect because if one function works on a client it does not mean it automatically works on another. Answer B is incorrect because Lotus Script can be utilized through specific events. Answer C is incorrect because the on submit event allows Lotus Script for the only notes client. Question 47. Acme would like to standardize how views display on the web and has asked Anthony to regulate all web views. How can Anthony do this? Create a dollar view template default form. Create a dollar view template default view. Create a dollar view template default form for each view in the database. Create a dollar view template default view for each view in the database. Answer is A. Create a dollar view template default form. A dollar view template default form will display all views in the database. Answers B and D are incorrect as there are no dollar view template default views. Answer C is incorrect as a dollar view template default form will be applied to all views and you do not need one for every view in the database. Question 48. Our administrator, Becca, has reorganized our website. She moved all databases pertaining to the company catalog from the product subdirectory to the catalog subdirectory. Our design team has started receiving reports that links referencing the product subdirectory are no longer working. We do not have time currently to rewrite all the databases. How can this problem be resolved? Take the application off the web server until the links can be rewritten. Create a website document for this application. Display an error page that tells users the site is under construction and to please return later. Create a substitution website rule document that redirects slash products slash to slash catalog slash. Answer is B. Substitution rules enable you to replace parts of an incoming URL with new ones. Answer A and C are solutions that are not viable to the company. Answer B is incorrect because rule documents are responses to website documents. Question 49. If the web access, use JavaScript when generating pages option on the basics tab of the database properties box is not checked, which at commands are not supported? At command, file save, at command, file close window, and at command, file, exit, window. At command, file save, at command, file close window, and at command, view, refresh, fields, none. If this property is not checked, a submit button is automatically created. None. If this property is not checked, the first button found on the form is converted to a submit button. Answer is B. Answer A is incorrect because the last at command is not one of the three not supported. Answer C and D are true statements, but do not correctly answer the question given here. Question 50. The admin team needs to temporarily change the web server. They would like to have web clients automatically go to the new site without having to type in or even see the new address. What can be done to accomplish this? Create an internal redirection website rule document. 
Create an internal substitution website rule document. Create an external redirection website rule document. Create an external substitution website rule document. Answer is A. Internal redirection rules allow you to redirect users to a new URL without displaying the address in the browser. Answer B and D are incorrect because substitution rules do not have internal or external types. Answer C is incorrect because an external redirection rule shows the new address in the browser.